Hello, I'm Mike from Music Radio Creative. In this fifth and final part of how to create your own perfect podcast intro, I'll show you in Adobe Audition how to polish up that intro and make sure it sounds really great. So let's have a listen to what we've got. This, 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 this is your podcast name here. The podcast about this, that, and the other. And now, here's your host, Mike Russell. Okay, so just a few things that we could do to polish off that podcast intro. First of all, I'm going to go in and maybe find uh, some sound effects that I can use to make this sound really good. So let's pick some out. Here we go. Let's have a look here. Let's see how we can use that effect somewhere and whether it's going to sound good or not. I'm going to use track six for this. This is... This is Okay, maybe that's a little bit overpowering, so I'm going to reduce it in volume. This, 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 this is this, 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 this. Okay, that's going to be a good place for that extra effect. I will change the color of this again to another kind of blue, and I'll call it extra SFX. There it is. This, 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 this is your podcast name here. Now I notice there's a bit of a gap here. The other. And now, here's your host. So let's put in some more effects here. That could work. Other. Other. Let's make sure that effect is on the beat. Other. And now, here's your host. And again here, I'm just going to do something a little bit clever with my host name. You can replicate this too. My, 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 my. Okay, I'm going to copy that. I'm going to start a new file. And I'm going to just um, basically go in and insert a little bit of silence. So I've got some headroom to play with. And then I'm going to pop that in. Effect, I'm going to pitch bend it a bit. So let's cut it down. There we go, perfect. And we need to put in a few of those because I want to reverse it. Womp, womp, womp. And then I'm going to do another effect, which will be time and pitch, stretch and pitch process. And this, I'm going to take it from 100 up to 80% so that it goes up a bit. And then I'm going to pop this into the multi-track where you hear the little vinyl scratch. And we're going to use this to make a, a mock vinyl scratch on the host name. There we go. Might need to speed it up just a little bit. As this vinyl scratch is a little bit slow. Trim that up. Trim that up. Then we're going to select it. Time stretch it down a bit. Move it across. And we're nearly there. We'll do the same with this one. Time stretch it down fit in with that little scratch there. Let's see how that sounds. Mike. Okay, and maybe another... Another effect can just pop in there, I think, to match up nicely. That's going to fit in perfectly in this section. Mike Russell. And I think we've got our finished podcast intro there. So I'm going to save the session file and you'll be able to download this very session, play with it yourself by clicking the link below this video. But next, I'm going to show you the final process, and that is to go into multi-track, mix down session file, entire session, so you get the full mix down of the podcast intro there. You'll notice the levels are a bit all over the place. That comes in low, and then there's lots of peaking going on here. Don't worry, in Adobe Audition, when you see something peaking, it isn't actually peaking if you've mixed it in the multi-track. There is a lot of headroom inside Adobe Audition to allow for that. So now I'm just going to go into effects and do a final little thing. I'm going to go into amplitude and compression, multiband compressor, and I'm going to go for pop master, which will flatten this all down to a lovely straight line. And when I play it back, you will hear the finished podcast intro that I hope you will enjoy. This, 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 this is your podcast name here. The podcast about this that and the other. And now, here's your host, Mike Russell.
So there you go. That concludes this five-part series on how to make a podcast intro. Now, you can go and do it yourself in Adobe Audition CC. Just click the link in the description to this video to download the session that you've seen me creating.